Well, people of different faiths gathered in prayer tonight to remember victims of the Newtown tragedy. 7 Action News reporter Julie Bonovich takes us to the interfaith service in Beverly Hills. They felt it was important to have this as an interfaith vigil because the children who died were from different faiths. Muslim, Jewish, Methodist, Presbyterian, Christian, they all came together to remember the victims of Sandy Hook Elementary. This really reflects America. We're a country of people, different faiths, different ethnicities and races, and interfaith uh, and activities like this is where I think most of the healing will take place. The Michigan Muslim Community Council led the way for tonight's prayer service at Groves High School in Beverly Hills. People really wanted to reach out, uh, look for solace amongst, for, uh, for a higher authority and it's a great way to bring people together to remember an event like this. They prayed for the families who had to attend funerals this week, especially for the families of those 20 children who are just six and seven years old. These uh, caskets have really been too small. Uh, it's very troubling, uh, very, uh, I'm speechless. Uh, there's really nothing to say when you see babies uh, being buried. So they asked for change, changes in their schools. We need to gather and re-examine what we are doing as a school district and to make recommended changes in order to uh, ensure our kids that are, are that much safer. And they asked for people to change the way they treat others in society. People like this that commit such actions, extending their hands and harming other individuals are people that are not commonly accepted in their communities. Afterward, everyone went outside to light candles and say prayers for those six adults and 20 children who will not be going home for the holidays. From Beverly Hills, Julie Bonovich, 7 Action News.